sometimes when you get these big yellows, especially out of a bit deeper water, they don't want to swim away. They gas up a little bit and they just can't get down. So a drop weight is the ideal solution. We don't have ours with us today, so I'm just using a little anchor. We've got a light length of six pound line tied to the bottom of the anchor and a barbless hook just very lightly through the lip of the fish. So she'll easily be able to get rid of that hook. And the whole idea is I'm gonna get it down to about 10 meters to repressurize her and then just break that light connection. So, into the water. So now I just lower her gently down. She's following that anchor down into the depths. I tied her an overhand knot, a granny knot in the middle of that little link too. So that's halved the, the breaking strain of it. It's six pound, it should easily break. And I get it right down to about that 10 metre mark. We're in, we're in 10 metres of water here. So when the anchor hits the bottom, there we go. And now I should be able to just give her a quick jerk. Worked perfectly. So that barbless hook is just sitting very lightly in the lip. She'll give a couple of shakes and that'll fall out. She's repressurized, much, much better chance to survival. It's a really good tip to know. You should carry a proper drop weight with you, but if you're caught without one, you can use something like a small anchor like that and just a link of light line to a hook. Make sure you crush the barb down on the hook so the fish can get rid of it. Bob's your uncle.